Hello YouTube, this is Bowtie Media, and today we've got another reaction forever and always by Armin Van Buren, Gareth Emery, and technically featuring Owl City, so it doesn't seem like there's any production help here from Owl City, it just seems like it's a vocal feature, at least from what I've seen from the title. But um, yeah, I am super excited for this track. I actually did put this in the voting for members for the uh, Friday reaction. It lost, but I felt like I wanted to talk about it anyways. So we got a special, <laughs> special another reaction here. We even did the Eden one as well. So we did <laughs> three of the four. So uh, yeah, I'm excited to hop into this. Uh, three like gigant gargantuan names in kind of electronic music. Uh, with the poppy Owl City, the trance house uh, Gareth Emery, and obviously Armin Van Buren, who's a huge name. So uh, this is on Armada Music. Let's hop into it. This is Forever and Always. I just don't want it to be basic. I want the song to have Nothing some life. left here in this town All of life has been shut down Take the last flight out tonight Set a course for the moonlight Say goodnight city lights Watch as they fade from sight I would follow you to the end Take a bullet again If we should die tonight, there'd be two more stars in the sky. Cause I would follow you to the end, forever and always. Forever and always. Okay. Very impressed so far, I'll say that. <laughs> Take a bullet again and again. And if we should die tonight, there'd be two more stars in the sky. Cause I would follow you to the end. Forever and all. Okay, Forever and Always, Armin Van Buren, Gareth Emery, featuring Owl City. Uh, <laughs> I thought that song was really bad, not gonna lie. Um, I've done a lot of these uh, reaction videos uh, in, in the past, I think over 100 now. Uh, that may be the worst one I think I've heard. <laughs> it's... I, oh my gosh, maybe it, it may just be the style that I'm not used to, um, but... Man, like that was boring. That was boring and that was not great. I I also don't love like that kind of trance sound, just the or it's not even trance. That was like it was like hap, it was like happy hardcore, but it wasn't, but it was trance, but it wasn't, but it was house, but it wasn't. It was like a kind of weird fusion of them all. It did have that constant like hardcore style beat, but 
man, that was, that was just, I don't know, it was boring. I thought it was, I thought it was mixed pretty poorly too. Uh, I think when uh, the Owl City's vocals, um, <laughs> uh, when the when the drop came in, uh, it just felt very abrupt and sudden, and then it was a little mixed too high, and I couldn't really hear the Adam Young, and so I, <laughs> I, so, I don't know that I don't know if that song is just for me, but I thought that was like, that is not great. That that is not that was that was not good. I don't think. There is, it wasn't, it wasn't much I enjoyed about that. It was for the for three big names. I expected this to be a lot more grand, a lot more entertaining, a lot more emotional. And that was, that was dry in many areas, but uh, that's it though. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Love to hear any and all thoughts, but with that, I'm Bowtie Media and I'll see you guys in another video.